comrades, a glorious day is upon us. The Generalissimo himself has requested our involvement in the liberation of Stalingrad. Things are going poorly in the city, but that is about to change. We are to lead a division of tanks to surround the Germans. They are too busy in Stalingrad to stop us. Once we have them in our hand, we will close the fist and crush them. Now this map may tell me to go fuck myself. It has in the past. It probably will, again, mainly because of this asshole right in here, who you come back later and play as, you me a pain. A really big pain in the buttocks. <clears throat> yeah, she started off with a tank, thank god. And you have two of that and two infantry. I'm gonna go ahead and move the infantry over in here. Might go ahead and get rid of this uh, tank, this light tank. Medium tank, light tank. And you know, you can go ahead and click in on the units and look and, uh, and kind of see. And I, I. <sighs> Panzer Force are not light tanks. You're doing it wrong. Just saying. What are you? You're a. I don't even know that one. My brain immediately assumed it as a check tank, but I know it's not a check tank. What are you, your key? Well, I, no, I, I, what am I doing? I don't know uh, Russian tanks. I know the T-34, but I do not know the KV-1. Uh, is that a, a heavy one? I, I, who knows? Who knows? I don't really care. I can go in that whole detail, but I'll probably do it whenever we go into the Axis campaign. Just because it makes a little bit more sense. Apparently, oh, the tank's uh, not activated. I was like, why the fuck is the tank not, uh, it's not activated? Anyway, um, and to get your mechanized and your armor division, you need to have the subsequent um, HQs. And you can, like, if you don't want it, you can delete it and that stuff, but it's really not worth it. So, go ahead and build your regular stuff. It'd help if I actually had the money to do that, but whatever. I'm gonna go ahead and destroy you. Or, you know, you're just going to run away. Fine, you're going to run away because the tank shot you. You know, maybe you shouldn't be doing that. <coughs> and uh, whenever it says, you know, go ahead and capture secondary cities, guess what? You kind of need to capture the secondary cities. You don't have to. However, it's really recommended that you do. Just because if you don't, then you're gonna have no. You're gonna just be grinding forever trying to destroy it. And trying to destroy it, trying to capture it. So it's not really worth it. It's much better to just go ahead and, um, you know, capture the cities. And you only have to capture them once, you don't have to actually hold them. And this guy's just trying to go off into the void. No. The blackness is the void of doom. You shall never escape it. Now I'm going to be keeping these uh, recon for a short period of time. I'm going to go ahead and send them down too as well. And what I need to do actually is go ahead and build up my supply trucks. Guess what I'm going to be doing? Expanding this damn border a crap ton. Make you second 10. I'll move you down too because why not? Now all along here you have uh, defensive units that well actually no, I'll probably be able to you'll probably be able to see in just a moment, but uh, they won't come after you. Um, even if you attack them, they'll go back to their main place. It's probably because they're set up to guard and guard units. They have like they have a radius that they're able to go into, but they generally will not leave that even to follow an enemy unless they're told to attack. But again, that's all different. Now, where do I need to put you? Yeah, come on, hurry up and deploy. I fear it's right, right about there. I used to know this really well where I'd kind of guess and be able to fit right into that zone. I think that should be enough. Again, we'll have to see. Need to go ahead and build up some more. Just because it's annoying as hell. Yep, and there's an enemy right there. I'm just gonna go ahead and move you back. Now that, um, that's an anti-tank, they have their entrenchment bonuses. Oh, I was like, what What the hell did they enter combat in with? I'm like, oh, the anti-aircraft gun. 
As you can tell, they don't do a whole lot of damage. He's got a lot of health. It's yeah, it's kind of bad news bears. And you can capture the city. You only have that anti-aircraft, uh, that anti-aircraft, that anti-tank, and you have a regular half truck regiment. Half trucks on their own just kind of suck. Uh, this is actually really good. Um, I was going to say the uh, TSC-222 um, was actually a pretty good half truck uh, for its time. It was used up until, I want to say, about the mid-60s by various nations. However, you know, that sort of stuff kind of waned a bit, um, if you know what I mean. Now, you know, you have, like, personnel carriers and... Um, stuff of that nature, but yeah. I'm not going to go into much detail about it because I don't really know a whole lot. And you had a glimpse of the units here. There's a heavy tank regiment, and um, I believe I can actually build heavy tanks here. Can I build heavy tanks? No, I can only build medium. You also have anti-aircraft tanks, which I never use. Um, aircraft generally aren't a huge issue. Oh yeah, we also have an ally. Um, ally, he kind of sucks, but one shocks the AI. They tend to not do very well. Now this is the normal stuff that you'll end up seeing is, you know, like improved AT weapons, which I'm definitely going to be using, and the recruitment stuff, and it's all very useful. That's all I have to say. Now all of you, where'd you, ah, uh, there you are. That button's also extremely useful when you don't know uh, when, <coughs> when enemy is, uh, god damn I can't speak. How many of stuff they need, need to attend to? I don't know why I'm having such a hard time speaking. Probably because I'm so not used to it. No, you gotta stop. Gotta let the inventory go first, attract the aggro. You attack that anti-tank, I'll have the tank support you. That seems kinda stupid, but whatever. You're gonna attack- okay, I was like, are you gonna attack that uh, anti-aircraft? But no. As you can see, even against infantry, the, um... The anti-tank gun's actually pretty good. However, um, I just don't really use it. And you can tell that, yeah, it, uh, I don't do a whole lot of damage to them, but they have, you know, they're in a forest, and they're entrenched, so yeah, they're gonna be pretty damn damage resistant, um, especially against light units like this. As you can also see, the uh, anti-tank are the only things that are actually doing damage to me, because, you know, their ta um, you know, their tank trigger or small fire is not gonna do much, and whenever the uh, lead unit ends up dying, then you're going to have a bit of a morale loss. As you can see, there was a 5-1 right there. So yeah, you're about dead, so I'm going to go ahead and retreat you back up. You as well, go ahead and just run back. Yeah, you should just kind of die, but whatever. But what I'm going to do right now is uh, I'm going to go ahead and cut um, out any of the progress, and I'm just going to go ahead and wait uh, until I'm actually able to do something. So I will be right back. Okay, and we are now back. I've gone six of my medium tanks, I have my artillery, and I have my anti-tank infantry. Now, I really you're already coming after me you know what whatever i'm gonna go ahead and deal with you now uh the ai it really depends sometimes they'll be nice and you know just kind of stay in their own little bubble sometimes they'll kind of tell you to go fuck yourself and i really don't care i'm gonna go ahead and bombard you there you go now uh as I've said, I really like having artillery, um, you know, artillery tank or artillery half trucks. The mortar teams of the infantry are not that good, just kind of, yeah, they're just not that good. I'm going to go ahead and move my tanks forward through here. There are some units that are going to be here. Um, not really anything I have to worry too much about, though going to go ahead and deal with you guys, and because they don't have an HQ that they're attached to, they do not recover any of their health. I'm going to lose a few units, but eh, I'll be fine. That unit's finally dead, they'll go ahead and take care of the anti-aircraft, and you don't have to. Um, you know, if you're playing one of those games, you actually won't, because the AI um, 
suffers through the same type of uh, techs, um, tech, same type of economic stuff um, that you do as well. I guess I should mention is that uh, you can go into negatives for like ammo and oil, and for every one um, that you're below, uh, like every one that you're negative in, you will uh, suffer a minus two to your uh, money every, um, you know, you'll get a minus two to that. So if you, you know, are really, um, if you're really negative, then you're going to be losing like, a lot of money and yada yada yada. You guys are pretty much done. And uh, one thing to note is that uh, any artillery, whenever they are doing their bombardment, they do not gain any experience, oddly enough. Um, they don't gain any experience, and so, you know, they're not going to be able to level just from doing that. There's going to be two more, I believe, anti-tank down at Laura on this bridge. And if you just move over here... Oh yeah, there's also anti-aircraft um, half-trucks, which... I don't know why this... Oh no, they're actually tanks. I don't know why they're here, because, you know, I can't build aircraft of any sort. So, who knows? Nor do I really care. I'm gonna go ahead and bombard you. Now, bombardment's actually um, really good for getting the unit to route, and you uh, can kind of, you know, they have a certain range they're able to hit, and yada yada, but again, it's fine. Now, whenever you capture a city, you do gain bonuses. However, um, if the city is like, uh, has been damaged in the fight, then they're, it's not going to give it to you for a considerable amount of time. And I don't like how, really, everyone around from those, from those goddamn tanks, they're not difficult to fight. Deal with them. You just run down, attack them. Now, you can also have them attack, like, one specific um, part of a unit, and whenever that one dies, I believe it won't attack anything further, but on that front, I'm not 100% sure. Now I'm going to go ahead and move this further back, because I'm going to go ahead and deal with that asshole that was so um, antagonizing to me beforehand. So I'm going to go ahead and build a whole bunch of these. I don't necessarily need the money, but just, yeah. You're all grouped together now, which is good. And the AI, um, your ally AI, uh, will normally capture this city, and if not, you can just quickly go ahead and do it yourself. Now, the guy's HQ is all the way down here, and so it's a long way from your supplies, and... Oh yeah, right, right, you're not dead yet. Whatever. Oh, it's a mortar team. Never mind. Mortars are very slow firing, they don't do a whole lot of damage, which is the main reason I don't like using them. It's just, they're, they're not that effective. And whenever you have oil depots, uh, supply depots, ammo depots, and that sort of stuff. Uh, whenever you destroy it, you'll get a little bit of coinage from that, which is nice. Um, I believe it's half of whatever... How much are you worth? Yeah, it's like half of whatever they, um, they actually are. So, I believe there are some modifiers that um, will make them cost a little bit less, but nothing all that important. Um, it's only like 30 gold, and I keep calling the gold. That's like the symbol used in gold, okay? That's what I'm used to just, um, you know, seeing and assuming, like, oh, it's gold. Yeah, it's totally gold. That's what they use, you know. They all use, they're all selling the gold standard. Totally, I mean, that's how Germany, like, bought a lot of their stuff. What do you mean it was from, you know, all the stuff that they captured? You know, that's actually completely totally true. Yeah, I'm gonna deal with you. Alright, you know, actually, no. I don't know why these tanks are being my ass. Oh yeah, and um, having all your units selected, like up in the quick bar, is so much more easy than having them, like all bunch here like this and trying to get them to do a specific task. Just because you're gonna only select six at once, and it's just a pain in the ass to really deal with. And when they're all grouped together too, they are not very smart. Like, you know, this guy is just like, how do I get over there? I need to join the fight. Yeah, they're not that smart. What a shock. Come on, keep moving. Keep moving. There you guys are. What's up? I should actually probably have the tanks in front instead of those. 
I'll go ahead and move him back some. You go ahead and deploy here. You need to deploy out here. You, I said you, no you. You deploy out here. Oh great, who's run? Oh my tanks are now. What's running away? Who knows? Oh goddamn engineers! I, no, no, nope. It's not going to happen. For anyone that's seen my uh, previous playthrough of this game, um, you will know that engineers are the bane of my existence. And so whenever I see them, I just get pissed off. And they just fucking, they, they just sucked. They are just so annoying. But who knows, maybe it won't be that bad this time. Or you know, I'm going to be completely and totally wrong. I, I know I'm not going to be. It's still going to be, you know, awful, but eh. You go ahead and deploy. I could always bring my inventory over, however, I prefer having some sort of covering force, and I should, um... I'm not going to have to move them back, but... No. Engineers, they're not going to do anything for me. And if I, uh, If I actually remember, I'll go ahead and put them, uh... I'll put that one clip in. From my old mic, so it's probably going to hurt some people's ears, but uh, you'll just have to lower the volume. I may or may not, it depends if I remember or not. I just probably won't. Yeah, you're all starting to lose some morale. I'm going to go ahead and pull you back then. Bravely run away. Where do you. Where are you? Oh, you're over here. That's a long way ways away. Going to pull you down over hither. You a little bit further. This is why having extended supply zones are so nice. So I don't have to send these units all the way back like I would have to otherwise. And whenever you have artillery like engaged in actual combat, it's so much better to have um, like do that bombard option and uh, just like do that. Because a lot of the time they you know like won't actually fire and. Yeah. You guys are all nice. And uh, your, uh, all your units, unless they are stopped, they won't actually um, gain the morale back uh, whatsoever. They have to be stopped to do that. However, they will gain health um, regardless, regardless of that. Oh yeah, I can just go ahead and just, yeah, just, just stop. You're all filled up. You may as well go ahead and keep moving. Go ahead and keep on moving down down. You know what? I'll even throw up the speed a little bit. We Super speed mo. Want my tanks in front though. Come on tanks. Keep moving. Keep moving. There we go. Now what are you doing? Why are you bringing your goddamn an HQ up here? That's stupid of you. It's also much better if, uh, if possible, to not have um, all your units intermixed. But sometimes you don't, you aren't able to, you know, really control that. Oh, you're great! You have medium tanks now. I'm just gonna go ahead and quickly deal with you. So many numbers, and uh, the number of things is something that I just kind of activated. Um, you don't need to have it on. Um, I just prefer to kind of have it on. I don't really know why. I like the pretty colors, that's why. Totally. I, mean, I guess I'm going to go ahead and have... Oh my god, there's so many of you. It's bad. And none of these are really going to help me. Actually, no, I think that one would... No, it's only infantry, so no, it wouldn't have helped me at all. You guys are about to die. Run the hell away. There's some anti-tank half trucks. Uh, also something that I use on occasion. I mean, if I really wanted to, all I would really need to do is destroy their HQ, but... Yeah, he's got a lot of units. I need to wait for my stupid fucking ally to actually go ahead and, and deal with stuff. You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna move you down because they're being too stupid to actually do it. Like, you know, they're supposed to. You should all be recovered, so come on back. All right, now you send everyone else against me. Oh, you're all about out of morale. That'd be no good. I gotta bring the speed back, back down a little bit. Nope, nope. 
Oh, great. Now I don't have control over any of you. Great. Yeah, I'm not going to try to bring you down. Just, just move. Keep, no, no, keep moving. Oh, you're at the point where you're like, fuck you. I'm just going to keep on fighting because, you know, I'm super goddamn intelligent. I'm like, dude, no, you're not. That's a really stupid move. I apparently have control of both of you. Thank God. You move back. You two also move back. See, this is what happens when you don't pay attention sometimes. Bad things will happen. I'm trying to get them in a spot where they'll hit. There you go. Whenever you have units all kind of grouped together and stuff, it will be a bit bad news. Um, just because, you know, like, shells and that sort of thing actually do have an area of, of uh, effect. So you gotta be a little bit more careful. That's also really good because, you know, then your artillery is a lot more effective and, you know, so is their artillery. And I'm just going to go ahead. Nope, I can't actually do that. They have, like, so many goddamn units. Is this only infantry? Yep, it's only infantry. That should be kind of figured. That should be kind of figured? Wow, good English there, mate. Yeah, where's the other tank? Hey. Hey. What the fuck are you doing over here? What are you doing? Go join your friends. You're an idiot. You're looking at the water. Do you need to, you know, is are you trying to refill your goddamn tank with a fucking river? Like how there's just, you know, like meandering, like little streams that just block it off. Oh yeah, there's actually fighting here. Holy crap, there is fighting here. I didn't know that. I've never taken this city normally. Oh no. Oh. Oh, there's oh, martyrs. Right. I forgot that, you know, mortars, they do a whole lot of, like, morale damage, and maybe I will just have to kind of bring the units back over. Fine. I, I completely forgot about that. Gotta wait for you to stop running. No, what are you doing? No, why are you attacking? No, go back. You're in... <sighs> stupid people. Stupid, stupid, stupid. No, I see you. I see you fucking moving up. You're not gonna take me like that. Uh-uh. No. Don't know why I can't see you. I just apparently can't. You know, actually, no. Screw you. Surprise, that actually works as well as it did. And the uh, no, frame rate's still fine. Sometimes when there's a lot of stuff going on, the frame rate just kind of, you know, dies. Gonna bond you really quick. There you go. Again, inventory. Uh, artillery is really good at uh, doing a lot of morale damage, even if it's not a lot of, you know, like regular damage. Just gonna go ahead and move it all down. And for a second, I thought there was. Oh. Why are you up here for? You're guarding the fucking engineer. Why? Why are you guarding the engineering brigade? What the fuck's wrong with you people? Yeah, he's stupid sometimes. Like, really stupid. No, all of you, fight. Come on, move forward. Gotta defeat the asshole. Gotta keep fighting, then I can focus my attention on actually conquering the goddamn city. Or, you know, I won't be able to. All of you, come on, just fight. Do you see why this game can be annoying sometimes? I don't know why you're sending all, you know, your trucks, like, out towards me so much. You just are. Yeah, come on. Can I, you know, or you know what I can just do? I can just, like, bombard from here. That works, too. And you're taking forever to actually move anything, like, forward. That's gonna take forever, though. Yeah, screw it. Can I actually get in here and, you know, like, do some damage? Or are you just gonna go now? I get the feeling you're just gonna go now. Uh, maybe, nope. Not gonna work. Not gonna work. Are you gonna actually, yes, you're gonna do what the hell I need you to do. Fine. You go ahead and run away then. All of you, I guess, can go ahead and run away too. As can you. Perfect. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and cut again, um, and just meet you back when I prepare my final assault on the stupid city. 
I'm not frustrated. I'm I'm obviously not. Just you know, extremely. Okay, finally back, because that took way too goddamn long. The AI is really stupid sometimes. There's like dark, there's a unit, there's a unit like, you know, over in here, and you know, nothing fucking happened. And yeah, I know, you're coming to be kind of an asshole. I don't really care. I'm going to go ahead and bombard your stuff. I'm going to go ahead and send my units. What is that all of them? Wait, I. <laughs> What the fuck are you doing out here? You, everyone's over here. You're over here. You know, you're trying to like flank out a unit or something. What? What are you doing? Follow the group of everybody. And yes, I know I lost. I lost a unit. Whatever. Just you. You're all stupid. Yeah, I know. I'm losing some stuff. I don't really care. I can just go ahead and like send in my unit. All I, yeah, fuck it. Just, just rush in. I was gonna say, actually, rushing is not the greatest idea, but whatever, I don't really care. Just, you know, fire everything, kill it, you know, destroy it, burn, burn, burn. Here, I'll even do this on you guys, because why the hell not? You now have uh, extra damage, and yay, and yah, and hurrah, and blah. You managed to do stuff, thank god. My throat's starting to become extremely hoarse. I guess I should have actually done it as you're, you know, trying to run into a goddamn city or something. Go ahead and attack that, because why not? All of you, move upward. Do stuff. I think... Oh, these are all recon. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, you're doing all plus two damage. I like how... Yeah, they're also doing plus zero. Is it... I guess it's only like to buildings or stuff, or who knows? They manage to do stuff, they're so good and awesome, and yeah. Now he goes back into fast motion. Whee! Everything's so fast and glorious and everything. Apparently, I lost a unit somehow. What the hell did I lose? I don't know what I lost. I just lost something. Yeah, no tanks. They ain't got nothing. Yay! Did it? I, is that going to be how I end like most of the missions and just like 400% speed? Yeah, that was the end of the mission. Huzzah! Yeah, I, I know I didn't keep Rost off, even though, yeah. Anyway, perfect videos, right? Um, yeah, it's going to be all for this episode. So I will catch you guys later.